And at number nine, did anyone out there know about this clear lemon meringue pie? Ooh, it oh, is yeah. real. Oh, oh no. Maybe someone here can try it. It takes a traditional lemon meringue pie with the use of gelatin in the filling that makes it see-through. Uh, We're not going to tell you it's easy, and that's because you're working with powdered gelatin, not just any old jello. Hey, I'm an expert on the powdered I know gelatin. You yeah. Yeah. That gelatin has to go through a process where yep. it starts out as a clump, yep. and through some heating and adding sugar, you get it to be translucent. If you try it, send us a photo. That looks really nasty. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, number eight, uh, retirement is a long way off for some of us, but uh, here's something to think about. A never-ending cruise. On November 6th, Life at Sea's MV Lara ship set sail from Istanbul. It's a three-year cruise with options to extend your living arrangements. The plan is to visit seven continents, 140 countries, 382 ports, and everything is included. Your living accommodations, food, drink, even onboard health care. The price is about $4,000 a month. Mm. That's not horrible. No. Consider this, the average price of rent in Manhattan is 5600 a month, and that's just rent. Mm. Yeah. It's a big commitment, though. Yeah. yeah. But you're on a boat for the rest of yeah, your life. Yeah, with huh? the same people. Eh. Uh, number seven, we told you yesterday about the difference between the London Bridge and the Tower Bridge. Yeah. The Tower Bridge is the cooler looking one. But there's some really interesting stuff about the London Bridge, too. Since medieval times, it's been rebuilt a bunch. The current version is steel and concrete. And, but get this, the 1831 version of the bridge was granite, and it was rather lovely. And in 1971, a guy brought it to Arizona. Hmm. For real. Robert Paxton McCulloch was born rich and got richer because he was a great inventor and entrepreneur. Uh, he was uh, founder of Lake Havasu City when he heard that London was building a new bridge to replace the one that was sinking into the Thames River. He decided to buy it for about two and a half million. Wow. Mm. Uh, over three years, with each stone block cataloged with a number, the bridge was dismantled and shipped through the Panama Canal over to California and then trucked to Arizona. And it's there now. Wow. Look at that. They still call it the London Bridge. And okay. it connects the main part of Lake Havasu City with what the locals call the island, which is mainly a residential area. How are wow. we just learning about I this? I don't know. Perry, I blame you. You're Mr. Backstory. You should have never heard of that. that one. Oh, that's a yeah. good one. Well, the people in London should be embarrassed because their new London Bridge is nothing yeah. compared yeah, to that old one. Oh, maybe yeah. this station should send me to Arizona in March. Yeah, I'll go with you. Maybe we can go off and check that out. <laughs> All right, number six, another one we can weigh in on. A woman named Jess okay. posted to an advice forum. So let's see if we can give her some advice. All she right. says, my husband's sister is getting married soon, and she has a really complicated dress code for her oh, wedding. Boy. The wedding is outside in a field in the middle of the day in a part of the country that is hot, but the dress code is black tie, long sleeves, and floor-length gowns. Oh, and here's the thing. Jess is pregnant. Pregnant. So she asks her future sister-in-law if it's okay if, you know, she passes on wearing a floor-length gown sure. in a hot field for eight hours. Right. Mm -hmm. She even sent the sister-in-law photos of three very appropriate dresses she was thinking of wearing. The sister-in-law shot them all down. Yeah. Yeah. Now it's a whole thing. The sister-in-law told the pregnant woman she was being selfish. Yeah. Okay. The yeah. pregnant woman is asking, am I the jerk here? Yeah. You think Listen. she is? Like, you're the first person to ever give birth in this world. Right. You know, no, a lot of these pregnant the ladies, weather. they yeah. go on, they think yeah. they're the only ones who've ever had a baby. You know who else has had a baby? About two billion other yeah. people on the yeah. planet. And Just wear the dress. Yeah, in tons of hot delivery rooms yeah. also, where they need to turn the Robert, AC Robert, come on, you were with us, right? I, Are you with us on I this? I don't like the bride making all these crazy demands, but mm. I don't see why the floor-length gown is any, you know, more stifling than one that comes up to your knee. That's not, yeah. a, you know, uh -huh. it's more like that you're standing standing in a field for eight hours in the hot sun. Yeah, Everyone yeah. should have a problem well, maybe with that. Maybe that'll move things along. Yeah. How do you get out of this? I don't know, that's but that sounds like... question you're always just... asking. Maybe she should have a cesarean section on the day of the wedding. That's, <laughs> that's yeah. it. Yeah. Gets her out of it, right? That's it. You got to come up with something. That's a great... Larry. Yeah. 
Brilliant. Or have a thinking. case of the vapors or one of those, yeah. you know, things that, I've you know. I've always said you should be a doctor. Like, yeah. Maybe yeah. Or something. Yeah. Uh, well, I predict a number of harmonious and peaceful family oh, guys. Oh, yeah, yeah that would be them. great. Blast. Good for them. Number five, ever wonder why outhouses have crescent moons on them? Yes. Probably not, but we'll tell you anyway. Crescent moons didn't show up on outhouses until the 1930s and lasted through the 50s. Some believe they carved a moon on the door for women and a sun for men. Others believe they carved out a moon to make it easier for people to open and shut the door, plus it helped with light and ventilation. And a solid theory involves mooning, you know, dropping your pants and showing your behind to someone. Yeah. This dates back to the 18th century. People first did it to make others laugh. Mm. 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 Uh. All righty. All right, number four. Uh, looking for ways to keep those annoying squirrels out of your yard? We found a trick that some farmers swear by. Uh, you need a spray bottle and some hot sauce, and that's it. You pour some water in there and you add some hot sauce. There's no real ratio. Just use your best judgment. According to the folks that need more farms on the old TikTok, it won't harm your plants or flowers, but it will keep the squirrels away. Another option is to plant some really hot peppers in the garden. Squirrels don't like those. Uh, this hack might also help if the squirrels chew on your cords, especially for people who like to decorate for the holidays. Mm. Yeah. So there you go. All right, number three, it was only a matter of time, the return of the statement necklace. Oh, yum. It's got the three Bs, bold, beautiful, and blingy. Mm. Yeah. Look for pearls, look for gemstones, look for multicolored stones. You want to walk into a room looking like, who, me? Yeah, yes, that's you. Right. <laughs> and here's the hint. <laughs> yeah. Follow the less is more rule. If you've got the necklace, you don't need giant earrings. No. Preach it. Keep them simple. And the same goes for rings or the bracelets. Yeah. It's called statement necklace for a reason. Yes. Because it speaks for itself. Boy, truth there. Right? Mm. You should yeah. snap that yeah. out. Mm -hmm. Snap it out. Yeah, right. All right, number two, the holidays are coming up faster than you'd think, which means engagement ring season. Is that mm. what this is? I don't know. Sure. But are you getting a ring or are you getting a shut up ring? Ooh. A shut up ring is exactly what it sounds like. A guy gives it to his girlfriend to shut her up. He doesn't mm. want to break up, but he doesn't want to get married yet. So he buys her a ring yeah. to buy himself more time. Smart. The hashtag shut up rings have nearly 40 million views on TikTok. Some people claim Joe Jonas bought Sophie Turner a shut up ring, either ah. to shut her up or to shut up his brothers because they were already married. Uh -huh. And, you know, now Joe Jonas and Sophie Turner are getting divorced. But that's just a fan theory, so who knows? Yeah, yeah, it's not the real science. Uh -uh. Mm. Huh. If you know, you know, don't you? What do you, I mean, yeah, nothing's going to be different in six months. No. 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 Mm. There's something like uh, you why buy the cow when you get the milk for free? Is that tied into this? Uh, no, it's not. Different, yes. it's a different story. Yeah. Or it's you know, the same story. Right. Yeah, right. in no. the ballpark at yeah, least. Yeah, I think the, so. No. Okay, it's, I know it's on farming. <laughs> That's just for farmers. Farmers, yeah. 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 I'm a city guy, so yeah, it's hard for me to yeah. get those things straight. And number one, this one's for Pat, the panda lover. Oh yeah. Never say no to the panda. No. These commercials from Egypt use a psycho panda uh -oh. who threatens people who oh, don't, don't want like to eat already. cheese. The fish there, act like tea. Just know why. This. Panda, made the hashtag. I'm gonna buy some notes to get one. It's to get people to eat cheese? <laughs> They're not eating the panda cheese? <laughs> wow. Like wow. That. Yeah. That's, that's a great commercial. <laughs> that could be a great promo it for could. us. Yeah. We get a family and they're watching some crap hole like Good Morning <laughs> yeah. America. Yeah. We got a panda there with a baseball yeah. bat. Yeah. Light them up a little bit. Wow. That's a great idea. That's 
that took a panda turn. How yeah, do you, what you think there? You didn't I didn't like, like it. I felt like it was a real misrepresentation <laughs> yeah. of those yeah. delightful, gorgeous creatures. Uh, yeah. Funny. Believe some of them have a dark right. side at some yeah. point. Though. No. Oh, that's huh. a night at night. <laughs> All right. Nine, 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 nine.